Add an armature single bone, turn on in front. Rotate it by 90 degrees, turn on X mirror. Bring this tip to the start of the back legs and EY extrude it out. With this part selected, shift E and extrude to the start of the legs. Select this part, EY and extrude it so it's aligned with the front of the legs and then EY and extrude it out one more time. Select this middle part, shift E and extrude it to the middle legs. Select this part, shift E and extrude it to the front legs. Select the end right here, shift E and extrude it out to the pinchers. In front view, grab all the leg bones and put them at the start of the legs. Extrude out once to the first joint, again to the second joint, and one more time to the end of the legs. In side view, adjust the joints to the joints of the creature, and you want to place these joints in the middle of the three loop cuts that we created. Adjust the other legs as well. Do the same thing in front view if needed. Grab the pincher bones and bring them to the beginning of the pinchers, and extrude it out once and a second time. Adjust as needed in top view. Select the mesh, shift select the armature, control P with automatic weights. Select the tips of the leg bones, E, Z, and extrude down. Select all six of these bones, Alt, P, and clear parent. They should now be unparented. In pose mode, select the unparented bone, shift select the bone above it, shift I, two active bone. In the bone constraints, put the chain length to three. Do the same thing for all the other bones. And now we got some sweet IKs. In edit mode, hit shift A to add a new bone right here. Select the four surrounding bones, shift select the new bone last, control P, keep offset. And now we got this sweet rig.